Welcome to this daily office with the Iona community, which is taken from the Iona Abbey worship book. The service follows the form of morning prayer which we use on Iona, and so there are different prayers and psalms each day, and, over the course of each month, a cycle of prayers for the world, for different communities, and for the concerns of the Iona community. The service is interactive and you are invited to join with the responses, psalm and prayers. You'll see all the words you need on the screen. Through the week you will also hear different voices, those of staff, of members, of associates and of their families responding along with you. We begin with our opening responses. The world belongs to God. The earth and all its people. How good it is, how wonderful. To live together in unity. Love and faith come together. Justice and peace join hands. If Christ's disciples keep silent, these stones would shout aloud. Open our lips, O God. And our mouth shall proclaim your praise. The Lord is my light, my light and salvation. Whom shall I fear? Shall I fear? The Lord is my light, my light and salvation. Why should I be afraid? The Lord is my light, my light and salvation. Whom shall I fear? Whom shall Oh 
shall I fear? The Lord is my light, my light and salvation. Why should I be afraid? The Lord is my light, my light and salvation. Whom shall I fear? Whom shall I fear? The Lord is my light, my light and salvation. Why? Protecting me from every danger, whom shall I fear? Should evil powers advance, should armies try to kill, let them surround me and let them attack me, I'll still trust God. One thing I ask the Lord, this only I desire. Always in worship to gaze at God's goodness and seek His aid. Preserve my God from harm, secure in Him alone. I will rejoice in the face of affliction and sing God's song. Move among us, God. Give us life. Let your people rejoice in you. Give us again the joy of your help. With your spirit of freedom sustain us. God, make our hearts clean. Restore us in body, mind and spirit. Let us pray. And now we have our prayer of confession. Trusting in God's forgiveness, let us in silence confess our failings and acknowledge our part in the pain of the world. Before God, with the people of God, I confess to turning away from God in the ways I wound my life the lives of others, and the life of the world. May God forgive you, Christ renew you, and the Spirit enable you to groan in love. Amen. Before God, with the people of God, we confess to turning away from God in the ways we want our lives, the lives of others, and the life of the world. May God forgive you, Christ renew you, and the Spirit enable you to grow in love. So now, as Jesus taught us, we say, Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name, your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread, and forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us in the time of trial, and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. We now have the response of faith. With the whole church, we affirm that we are made in God's image, befriended by Christ, empowered by the Spirit. With people everywhere, we affirm God's goodness at the heart of humanity, planted more deeply than all that is wrong. With all creation, 
we celebrate the miracle and wonder of life, the unfolding purposes of God forever at work in ourselves and the world. Save us, good God, in a world without integrity, where none can be trusted. People tell lies to each other. They are masters of double speak. God, bring an end to such talk and silence the tongues that brag. We can talk our way out of trouble. With spin, we will win the day. Now I will act, says God. Now I will answer the prayers of the oppressed. I have heard their cries. I will give them the safety they long for. The, the promise of God, God is pure, refined like silver and gold. Though wickedness thrives all around, though shamelessness meets with applause, you, our God, will protect us and save us from all that we fear. Listen now in the reading of Scripture for the Word and Wisdom of God. The reading is taken from the Gospel of John, chapter 15, verses 18 to 20 and 26 to 27. If the world hates you, be aware that it hated me before it hated you. If you belonged to the world, the world would love you as its own. Because you do not belong to the world, but I have chosen you out of the world, therefore the world hates you. Remember the word that I said to you, slaves are not greater than their master. If they persecuted me, they will persecute you. If they kept my word, they will keep yours also. When the advocate comes, whom I will send to you from the Father, the Spirit of Truth who comes from the Father, he will testify on my behalf. You also are to testify, because you have been with me from the beginning. The Word of God in Scripture for the word of God among us, for the word of God within us. Thanks, Thanks be, be to, to God. God. Were I the perfect child of God, whose faith was deep and love was broad, not doubtful, guilty, worn, nor flawed, I'd gladly follow Jesus. But I'm the child of what I've been, estranged by much I've done and seen, afraid to show the love I mean, and fit to follow Jesus. Yet God, who knows me first and last, who's seen my best, my worst, my past, has shown his love intense and vast by meeting me in Jesus. For Christ, though killed at Calvary, by sins like mine and folk like me Has risen, forgiven and set me free Made fit to follow Jesus Then sprinkle water on my brow As in this place I make my vow To own and love my Saviour now and give myself to Jesus. God grant me what I still require, that I in others might inspire the hidden hope 
the deep desire to love and follow Jesus. God grant me what I still require, that I in others might inspire the hidden hope, the deep desire to love and follow Jesus. Blessed are the medical workers. Blessed are those who give their lives trying to ease the suffering of others. Blessed are those who gave their lives trying to save other lives. Blessed are those who didn't leave their patients even in the face of danger. Blessed are those who drove ambulances to save lives in the face of death. Blessed are those who still operated under attack and amidst trouble. Blessed are those who offer gentle hands of care despite violence and destruction. Blessed are the, are the patients who didn't survive. Blessed are those who are still surviving. May all their souls be cradled in God's heart and on the universe's lap. Blessed are those who do not give up hope. Blessed are those who refuse to hate. Blessed are those who do not kill. Blessed are those who refuse to separate between us and them. Blessed are those who give life. Blessed are those who seek peace rooted in justice. Blessed are, blessed are those who care and love to the end. This is the true power to change the world. Amen. On the 25th day, we pray for associate members of the Iona community and for friends of the Iona community. And we pray for the following countries, the lands and their peoples, Angola, Botswana, Eswatini, Lesotho, Mozambique, Namibia, South Africa and Zimbabwe. And we pray for members belonging to the family group of Wessex North, David Osborne and Madron Osborne, Anne Sear and Peter Sear, and for members belonging to the family group of Wessex South, Penny Gardner and Jeff, Rosemary Reimer and Stephen Reimer. And on this day of the month, we pray for associate members in England, South West. Walk with them today, O God, and keep us on your way. Ever present God, set your blessing on us as we begin this day together. Confirm in us the truth by which we rightly live. Confront us with the truth from which we wrongly turn. We ask not for what we want, but for what you know we need, 
as we offer this day and ourselves for you and to you. Amen. Amen. This is the day that God has made. We, we will, will rejoice and be glad in it. We will not offer to God offerings, offerings that cost us nothing. nothing. Go in peace to love and to serve. We will seek, seek peace and, and pursue, pursue it. In the name of the Trinity of love, God, God in community, holy and one.